Hey YouTube, this is Winner 3010 and today's video is on how to create password prote protected confidential folders. So it's actually pretty simple. It's a new thing which is common to Windows 7 and uh, it wasn't there earlier in Windows XP and Vista. Sorry about my bad voice. It is because of my bad microphone and still haven't got time to fix it. So it's pretty simple. You uh, go to your whatever browser you have, click on it. It takes some time, always. So, okay. So, what you have to do is just go on this link, it is there in the description. And after you go on this link, it's still loading. This link has the format for the password protected folder. It is. It'll come. Yeah, it's loaded now. Why does my computer only have to be so slow? Ah, uh, it's loading. Yeah, so this is the format for the password protection folder. Anyways, it's too small for anyone to read. Just go and click on the download button here. So what you do now is you close the browser and go to the place where you saved it. This is where I saved it. Double click on it. This is the format for the password protected folder. The folder will be named private. So, think of password. So I put a place, it says password goes here, this place, it is a place where your password should go. So what I do, I cut this, instead of that, write some password, I write private as a password. No, that, that's all you have to do. After you visit, go to file, save as. Now don't save it as anything, just save, just write what you want to save it as. Or you could as, um, what do you say, you can save it as Windows. Uh, put a name so that others cannot identify what type of file it is. You can name it Windows Best File. File. Now, you don't save it as .txt. You click on this part and click on all files. Now, after writing Windows back file, you put a dot and type B A T. Yeah, that's it. This is what you have to do. And press save. So, you close this and go to the place where you saved it. See, look, look at this. It looks absolutely normal. It looks like a Windows some configuration file. This is your private folder. You double click on it. Up this here comes the folder. See? This is the folder empty. You can put whatever you want here. Close it. And when you want to close it, double click on it. Last are you sure you want to lock the folder? Why? For yes. For then for no. So you write why. And press enter. Boom. STG locker and it's gone. For is gone. I'll show it again. Double click. The last enter password to unlock the folder. The password is private. P R I V A T E. And now, here comes private. So, you can save this as whatever you want. Like if. I want to put this format for the confidential document. I cut this and I paste it into a folder private. And then I close it. And do you want to lock the folder? Why? Enter and the folder is gone. See? The, uh, it keeps the information safe unless you need to put the password. And I should put it on the desktop, but uh, if you think that's an 
could not say if, you could put it in some other place also. Uh, there's nothing like that. Uh, some of our friends put it in the recycle bin, uh, so you can understand what it is. So, I'll show it to you again. Double click, password, private, enter. I, I think so, I was spelling wrong. P R I V. Private, yeah. And the folder comes. Double click, here, the document which you put in it, it's completely saved. So, that's it for today. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.